I'm actually not going to finish that story because I quickly become derailed into a little diatribe that is um, something I want to talk about sometime when I have the adequate attention span to, to devote to that. I'm about to go fuck a cat up. God damn it, kitty. Spray, spray, water, 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 water. I'm gonna keep spraying the little asshole. Stop it, poopy. River, you're, you're basically in a shower. Is this enough yet? Oh, what are you doing? How did you even get in here? Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. I'm so sorry, Poopy. I didn't understand. Straight up. Come on. What the fuck? River, I'm so sorry, baby. Come here. I'm sorry. I didn't understand. I'm sorry. Come here. Oh, my baby. I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Oh. My baby. Oh, my foofy. You should always get the whole story before you react. Hmm? I know better. <sighs> oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, baby. Okay. Mm. You're all wet now. You needed a bath anyway. Oh. You forgive me? Mm. It's okay. I'm so sorry. Mm. You're okay. Okay, so I'm such an asshole. Uh River was uh, growling at the stray cat who was inside. I didn't realize he was inside. Sometimes the stray cat will poke on the window where River slits and uh, River will growl and howl. And that's what I thought he was doing, but he was growling and howling because stray cat was in the fucking house sitting on that same ledge. He was expecting the window would be open so he could escape that way. I don't know if that made sense to y'all. I feel bad though. I'm gonna have to give Foofy something extra special, like a little dollop of tuna or something. Because you shouldn't give tuna to your cats, particularly your male cats, when they're fixed. It's bad for them, just in case you didn't know that. What was I talking about? Anyway, I just wanted to be really, really very honest about the fact that if it hadn't worked out with the plumber dude coming over and fixing this, to where I get to take a proper bath. I would be a snot, sniveling fucking mess. <sighs> More likely to move out than uh, move out and definitely have a, a year lease in a city I'm not sure I want to stay in anymore, as opposed to calling people that are in charge to get adequate permissions to have the water shut off and blah, 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 and then call a fucking plumber and blah, 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 because I super struggle with talking to people in positions of authority if I have to ask. Asking permission is just, a, that's tough for me. Um, And since there is very little I feel I can do, but it's something I'm so passionate about, the whole like, you know, the varying forms of abuse people go through and uh, mental health and fuck, I might be a crazy person, you know? But talking is about all I can do, so I feel compelled to do that. I don't know what else to do. And while I sort my shit out, I wanna feel like I'm somewhat contributing I feel like such an asshole, my poor kitty. I also think I need to name Stray Cat because Stray Cat doesn't really have a nice ring to it. I wanted to name him Zoldu because he's the exact same coloring as Zelda. You know, I mean, he's that purple gray and he's really green, piercing eyes, you know? Zelda was a real purple gray cat, piercing green eyes, just beautiful. And he's real pretty too. 
Anyway, don't know what I would do with all my cats. I really don't.